you are going to have a significant uh, 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 displacement in some sense in the kind of skills and other things that people are going to use for doing their jobs. Right? Can, can you just specify some of the areas where the skills and jobs will be affected more? I wish I had a crystal ball, I could tell you that. Uh, so one thing that we are seeing significant uh, 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 changes, right, is in, just in communication, right? So how do you write? Right? So people can, or uh, in fact, like I was jokingly saying the other day, uh, one of the immediate impacts of AI is the quality of letters I get asking for internships has improved tremendously in the last year or so, right? So I find people writing very well framed uh, sentences, talking about my research, summarizing it in like three sentences and so on and so forth. And I mean, it, it sounds very nice when you read it. But then you, you, you see the fifth letter that has the same kind of text in it, then you know that these kids are all using AI to generate these, right? So communication is going to become very good, right? So I mean, so everybody, I mean, whether you know how to write good English or not, Right? If, as long as you are able to communicate your thoughts to the AI, right? I mean, put some fragmented sentence in and ask it to give me a good, good paragraph or good, good essay on this topic, it's going to be able to do that. Right? So that is one thing. So any, 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 any place where you rely on your ability to wordsmith, right? uh, it's going to be challenged. Right? So that is one place which I see. The other one, of course, you see a lot of uh, impact in is in programming. So the, the basic expertise in you know syntax, right? being able to correctly just write the code without mistakes and debugging and things like that. So that skill is going to get less and less uh, uh, value, right? So what you're going to see is uh, you need people who can, you know, conceptualize a solution, right? Take a problem, break it down into pieces, break it down into modules, and then use the AI to write those modules and then use the AI to test those modules and, and so on and so forth. So you are going to need those kinds of skill sets more and more. It's not that programmers are going to go away. But the kind of skills you would need to become a good programmer is going to change, right? And, and it's going to enable a whole set of new things that you can do, right? So, so while earlier programming was like a niche, right? So you needed to have a big enterprise company that's going to work on putting out well-tested software. Now with the easy tools to write code and test software and things like that, you can have a boutique company of four people writing, you know, starting to write, uh, you know, bespoke code for, you know, small mm. companies that yeah. want to put out a specific solution. So those kinds of... Uh, 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 you know, uh, jobs are also going to get enabled. So the, the advanced skill sets that AI is putting out is going to help you to look at different kinds of problems that we weren't able to solve earlier. But like I said, these are two things which I know for sure will get significantly affected.